Hi, welcome to online digital marketing training. In this video, I'm explaining about uh, business manager account in Facebook. Uh, you already know that uh, ads manager, if you want to run any ads, you need ads manager. So you have to go to facebook.com slash ads manager so that you can create ads. If you are running ads for yourself, for your own company, uh, and you have very less business, one or two businesses, ads manager is enough. You don't need to go for a business manager. So business manager is important for the mostly like agencies. Like you have many clients, you want separate analytics for different uh, clients, then you can go for business manager. As most of my audience is uh, students and uh, individual company owners, you don't require any business manager anyway. But uh, having a knowledge on business manager is always important. That's why just go through this. Uh, before that, just see what there are some limitation on the ads manager. So you can run ads for all your pages you have created through ads manager. But the problem is with the analytics. Detailed analytics is not given for a different uh, ads account. And uh, you can't give your ads manager access to someone else if you don't have a business manager account. So you need business manager. Assume that uh, you're not perfect an ads manager, you need some help from others, then definitely after create business manager, then only you can create, you can give access to them. And one pixel in one ad account, you can't create multiple pixels anyway. Now suddenly you got one more client, uh, with the existing ads manager account, you can't run because you need a pixel. For that, either you have to take uh, access of their Facebook ID and password, which is not possible, they will not give. Or else you have to create a separate Facebook account, take the page access, then create account. So instead of that, creating a business manager is, so conclusion is, if you're a small advertiser, you don't have much client, you don't need to go for ads manager, students not at all required, but if you have more clients, go for the business manager. So in this image, you clearly understand, one second. So you have to go to business.facebook.com, click on create an account then they'll be asking you some details, finish them. Then after that, you keep on adding the account that I'm going to show you in a PPT. So here they clearly explained why you have to choose business manager. You need more than one ad account. Fair enough anyway. Generally you'll be required only one ad account, but if you want more ad accounts, definitely you have to choose business manager. You need to request access to ad accounts. You want to check other ad accounts, how they're performing. They ask you to do it. Then you need a business manager. You need to assign permission to a lot of people working together. Obviously you have 20 clients. One person can't work, right? You have to give assign to your employees at the time to manage the permissions. Definitely business manager. required. Finally, business level insights and reporting. You need a separate analytics for each business. Definitely business manager is important. So come to business.facebook.com, click on a create account. Make sure that you already have a Facebook account. You already have one page and you already have one ad account. Then start doing a business manager. I'm going to show you a PPT here. I'm just go very fast. Whenever you want, you can pause it, you can watch it. So clearly mentioned in the PPTs, this is how it look like. Click on create account. So give the details here. Then if you really have a good ad accounts, it look like this. Then click on the business setting top right. And uh, yes, you can add an ad account or you can create a new ad account or you can request access to an ad account, third party client. Even also, you can also create pages here or else request access to page or else add a page. This normally with ads manager also you can do it. At the same time, uh, you can request Instagram business accounts also here. So everything is done, you'll be getting message like this. So with the business manager, you can add pages, you can add ad accounts, you can assign work to the people. And this is the structure actually, the business manager structure. Then uh, I show difference between admins and the employees. Just go through them, pause and watch it. And this is important anyway. When you assign a rules, 
there are five layers actually so page admin page editor page moderator page advertiser and analytics analyst so page admin have all the access whereas the page editor apart from the admin rights remaining all they can access now these people have a limitations whereas analytics to analyst only can watch the analytics not more than that same as facebook ad account rules and facebook account rules that's it guys so try to create an ad account the business manager account anyway but make sure that you already have a facebook account a page is there one ad account is there thanks very much. today only you created a facebook account create a page it's not possible a uh, new account it will asking to wait for some days then only it will be giving you access okay so even now i'm not running uh, much clients that's the reason uh, i don't have uh, so this is my business manager account as of now three accounts are there but there are no much ad accounts because most of my clients into google ads and seo uh, facebook i didn't take much clients so i don't have much information on that so if you have any questions put a comment i'll try to answer thank you very much guys